guys, you're uh, in the corner again like normal. <laughs> I'm like always in this corner, but uh, gonna have a pretty fun video and informational video. Top right in. First thing I want to do is you saw the title, there's a announcement of a giveaway. Today's video is on my camera because I did go airsofting for the first time this season or year uh, on Friday. Uh, this is how I have two mounts, mounting ideas right now. I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to do make the other one if you're like a DIY one or saving money and stuff. Because uh, I want to spend that money elsewhere and put it on like guns and stuff. So I bet you, you guys are tired, like, he's been going at this for a year and he still hasn't gotten a whole new gun. Yeah, I know, I'm not that, the most exciting YouTuber. But, is, the, the first mount is this bicycle mount that's gonna go right here on my gun. And then, you just mount it right here. I posted a picture of this online, so you should be able to see it. And then I flipped the video right here. And you'll see the little bit tip of this, and then I get some video from there. And then once in a while, I'll take it off and put it on my head. That's what we're doing today, is I uh, put mounting the thing on my head. Figuring out how to make one. Uh, because I'm not going to go out and spend $20 on a stupid head thing where I, I can make this tops 5 bucks. But don't need the gun anymore, so uh, put that off to the side. Well, hopefully, I'll actually be selling this once I get my other t new. Once I get other guns, so I can have my other guns and just switch them out. But we're for, what we're gonna need is some alcohol and water, which I did half and half mixture into this bottle, which I have stuff written on it. Hey, don't use it's alcohol and stuff. But this is uh, just a little headlamp. This is what it looks like. What before. You do anything and come when it's in the wrapper and stuff. We we'll put off that off to the side and not tearing that one apart. The only reason I did it is because I lost the battery cap on this one, so it's useless now. And they aren't even that good anyways. But I wanted this plate. This plate's the thing that it gets mounted to. So we can go boop boop. So first you take a hacksaw, cut this off, get this nice flat, and then I and then I took a chisel and made it a lot flatter and smoother but chisel's done oh and also if your mount doesn't have the sticky thing already on the thing which I just barely actually did put this on you have to do that and then you can do this and it says to wait about 72 hours I'm gonna wait 72 hours when it's mounted to this but not putting this thing on It'll. It'll be more than 72 hours before I go airsofting, but after 72 hours, I'm going to shove it, my GoPro on this, and I'm going to run around, do some stuff, check out my mount. But, oh, and you're also going to need a crappy rag. I'm giving away, I want to give away, I'm thinking about 500 subscribers, my old camera that I used to use. Sometimes it had an error, it would not focus, so I, try, I mostly used my phone. But that's because I didn't have a good SD card. It's 14 megapixel. It's got pretty good zoom. Blink detection. It's a pretty good camera. Especially for starting. It's, just, it's Unless you got the super high-end phones, which if you're looking for a budget camera, or get one you want for free, it's really good. But, yeah, I'm thinking 500 subscribers for that. So, if you guys get subscribe, if you guys subscribe, you can uh, and share, you can get it to the 500 subscribers soon. But you're gonna take your towel, little rag, whatever you got, fold it up into pieces. And this is just part saying. This is just I didn't want all the straps to get in my way, so I can clean it. But. You're going to put it like on the corner, and you're going to dab it like three times. <laughs> uh, and, then, and then this half alcohol, half water mix will dry pretty fast. 
but it also gets it gets rid of all the dust so it's super clean and sterile from when you put the sticky mount on so you can get the maximum out of it you don't need to but it, I was told that it gets the best so I'm like and I'll spend that little bit extra time that little bit much more out of my sticky mount and then you're gonna still and then you're gonna peel this red mount off should be really sticky and then you're gonna put it in your exact place you if you want it like this or this you kinda like just play around it with it before you mount it I figured out how I was gonna do it before I did the video so I didn't have to wait for you guys well, do it in the video and make a long video that much longer then you're gonna need a C-clamp I sort of told you all this at the beginning but oh well I'm not perfect uh, and then I'm gonna clamp it to this and I'm gonna leave this in there for 48 hours and then let it cure on itself Unless I see it, I'm going to keep a close eye on it. And if I see any problems with it not forming right, then I'll change it. But when you put it on there, make sure it's nice and flat and level. Not, not crooked. Should have got my little level right here with me. I'm actually using the curved ones. Curved uh, GoPro ones. That'll get you on and that'll get you a head mount to put right here above your face goggles and stuff. But if you're not airsofting, uh, you can use it for everything. It's not just limited to airsoft. That's why I like this option. and Especially because I don't have a helmet. It was a better option for me. That's what I'd suggest for doing it. I'm uh, thinking next week I'm going to do a review on my friend's gun. After you're done, you'll shove these straps on and maybe you put some like camouflage on this so you don't get, hey, he's right there. I have a hat that I wear, so I'm just going to put it under my hat so I don't have to worry about it. And if you saw the last video, which not really many of you did, it was, I have like four views on it right now. It's kind of weird. I normally get a lot more views than that, but. Not a big deal. It's probably because it had an error, so it wasn't on the right day. So you guys all are probably like really busy because you're like used to me posting it on Monday morning or Tuesday. I ended up having an error, and I couldn't fix it on the Monday night. So I did it on Tuesday night, so I got the video up on Wednesday. Don't forget to check out that last video. I think it was really cool, especially because all the film from it was from this. All my friends are getting cameras like this now. One of them didn't get this one. The other one is pretty sure he's getting this one. And uh, next week's video, I, I believe also I have another package coming in the mail. So I think I'm going to have an unboxing and the review. I'm hoping for the review. I'm not sure on that. I'm pretty sure on the unboxing, but yeah. Don't forget to uh, freaking Airsoft. That's what this channel is freaking about. And it's about it was freaking about that. And I've never put Airsoft film out and it's been freaking almost a year. On my one year anniversary, for sure, I will be having freaking film. For my one year anniversary, why not? Let's do two videos that week. Just to celebrate. But, yeah. Don't forget to airsoft.